And over 200 hockey players from remote First Nations are in Thunder Bay this weekend for a fundraising tournament. The North Star Air Casey Tate Memorial Click Cup Tourney features 12 teams, raises money for people who've had to travel to Thunder Bay for kidney dialysis and other renal treatments. Jonathan Wilson has the story. This is the coveted trophy that everyone wants to win here at the Fort William First Nation Arena. The co-organizer of the charity tournament, Jonathan McKay from Sandy Lake, spoke about how this has become known as the Click Cup. The Click is kind of a big, kind of a staple with our, in our food and all that. And uh, so we, it started off just kind of, it started off as a joke when we first started it in 2014. But now it's, it's sort of picking up and everybody is getting on board with it. The Click Cup started off in 2014 as a way for hockey players and their families from remote communities to gather for one weekend in Thunder Bay every summer. But when one of the organizers died of kidney failure in 2018, the focus changed to a fundraiser. One of our great friends ended up passing away, Casey Tate. And uh, he was a guy that uh, he loved hockey. He had his uh, struggles with uh, his uh, kidney disease, so he needed dialysis. He needed that renal treatment. After he had passed away, we ended up kind of moving the focus of the tournament to kind of help people who were in similar situations. And in keeping with Casey Tate's friendly nature, the players are all now drafted to one of the teams representing 12 First Nations, so that new friendships are made every year. Meeting new people, meeting new friends, meeting new hockey players. And winning. Yeah, and winning. <laughs> How bad do you want the Click Cup? I want to repeat so bad, but there's a lot of stiff competition, so we'll see after Sunday. Sometimes you can hear, see people kind of mo moaning and groaning, kind of that type of thing where they're, oh, we got to play for Sandy Lake when, when you're from Pekanskum. But it, in the end, it's all, it's all fun. This is the first Click Cup tournament since 2019 before the pandemic, and it's gotten bigger than ever before with a record 209 players. McKay says between tournament fees and help from many sponsors, they'll manage to set a new fundraising record for the cause. Including the donations that we've been getting from communities, I think we... We'll be, after our final numbers are tallied, we might be pushing over 30000 for the tournament. And 30000 will go back to helping people who have to come from their reserve and to come out here to seek treatment. Jonathan Wilson, TBT News.